Hey everybody, it's Isaac here, back with another video. In today's video, I thought I would make a video about all the extensions that I think are very useful for improving your experience on NitroType. As you can see, we still have this five minute limit. Unfortunately, that is going to be a thing from now on, because I cannot seem to get it to go away. I used to have unlimited recording time, and now I don't. If I have to purchase Loom Pro, I will, but if I don't have to purchase Pro, then I won't. Um, yeah, we're gonna get started. Um, we're just gonna jump right in. So the first one I recommend is Stylish. Now, I'm not gonna go into it detail, because I have five minutes to record, and it's not showing my recording thing. That's great. But anyway, what it does is you can get custom themes. Like I said, if you want to know how to use it, you can go to Penguin Typer's YouTube channel. I'll link that in the description. He does a really good job of explaining it. You'll have to search it up on his channel, but once you do, he does a very good job of explaining this. Next one is Style Us, which is basically the same thing as Stylish. You can even get styles from Stylish on Style Us, but you can make your own styles, which is really cool. And if you look at um, Nate's YouTube channel, which I'll have pulled up here in a minute, you can actually see how to make your own styles. Um, and they're pretty easy to do, you just have to swap in a few images, but I've made my own before. And yeah, it's just a really cool extension. Another one is Auto Reload for Nitrotype. Um, I hope Nate doesn't mind me using his video for this, but you know, Auto Reload for Nitrotype, if you have a slightly slower computer, this will save you a lot of time because it automatically reloads once the race is done. But if you have a decently fast computer, it probably won't make a huge difference, maybe a few seconds, but unless you're doing a large grind, I wouldn't think it would make a big difference. But if you're really strict on like conserving time when you race, this would be a fantastic thing. Um, I'm not going to link the extension to this because you actually have to install multiple things, but I will link this video. He does a really good job of explaining it. Um, and then the last one being the NitroType Customizer. This is a track settings. You install it. Don't worry, it won't like take any passwords or anything like that. I forget who it's made by, like specifically who it's made by, but it's really useful. Um, I should probably use this, but I don't. You can hide your mouse cursor on the track. You can be in online mode and not get notifications. You can do all sorts of stuff with this. You can even have like preloaded themes on this, which is really cool. Um, and yeah, that's all of the extensions I can think of. I personally like using stylish, especially around like holidays. If I want like a Halloween theme, I'll install a Halloween theme. If I want like a Christmas theme, I'll do my Christmas theme. Uh, I'm developing my own Christmas themes that hopefully I'll have that perfected soon. I'm also going to get a new YouTube logo. I have one designed. Unfortunately, nobody entered the contest for designing them. But, you know, that's fine. I ended up designing my own and I really like it, so you guys will be able to see that soon. And yeah, I think that's it for today's video, so thank you all for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed this short video. I will try to remember to link everything I can in the description. And yeah, have a wonderful day.